Hello, my beautiful people. So, I am back in Big Rob's kitchen today. Y'all already know what to do. That is to subscribe, comment, turn on those notification bells so you don't miss any of my comment, share, and uh, set thumbs up. Now, today, I will be doing two different kind of chickens. I have the drumsticks and I have the sweats. So, what I'm going to be doing taking some carrots here and have some grease here that's uh, warming up in this pot here so yeah so I'm going to be frying me some which I shouldn't be having anyway fry me some flats and some drumsticks I've already cleaned my chicken very well the seasonings that I'm going to be using in this Pyrex so I'm going to go ahead and throw a bit and my oven is preheating on 350 Alright, 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 alright. So how y'all doing? Are y'all being safe out there? Okay, so yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, put four pieces of big pieces. Okay, so that's what my thing I say. So, okay, this is what's going to be going on his chicken. We're going to be going in with some onion powder that I need. I think I got some, but it's in the other cabinet. I just, I'm being lazy. Extra lazy. Oh, make it, make it a mess. Okay. We're going in with a little parsley. His chicken is going to be baked. Mine should be baked. But I, I, I'm sorry. I got to have my fire. I'm going in with some garlic. Y'all already know garlic. Be careful with the seasonings, because you can't over season. Y'all are in the glories. I'm going to start preheating my little heat going on over here for my chicken. This is going to be a quick meal. We're going to eat it with a pasta and broccoli. Okay. Now, and black pepper for his chicken. And that's it. That's what's going to be going on his chicken. All right. That's how that go. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to get me some land of oaks and massage this chicken for him. It ain't no more land of oaks. It's gone. So now I gotta open up a whole new butter. See that? Don't you crock. So yeah, so I'm just going to be throwing a couple of pieces like that up in there. Like that. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to give it a bath. I'm going to massage it. Give it a nice little bath. So the seasonings can be equally Contribute it. See that? That looks good already. Okay. Chicken ain't gonna take no more than 30 minutes to cook. Okay. So let's have that go. Go ahead and take it. A little water in the corners, just a little bit, because you know that um you also know that chicken makes its own grease and water. Then I'm going to go ahead and wrap it. With some foil. That's it, that's all. Go right inside the oven. <clears throat> oh, 
Okay. So his chicken is good to go. So now, I made a piece of comfort. This is the chicken going on. And this pan over here is already cleaned. A couple of pieces. My um, oil is getting hot for me. So I'm going in. I don't use my seasoning on my chicken. Not on fried. So I'm going in with some lorries. A little bit. Bam! That's how that go. Black pepper. Bam, bam. That's how that go. I'm going to go in with what you call Sasson Goya. Just a half a pack. This stuff can become salty. And I already suffer from hypertension. Like I shouldn't be eating this fried chicken. I should be baking my chicken like his. And that's it. That's all. See? That's how that go. And then uh, you take your flour. Very easy meal that I'm cooking tonight. I always cook easy meals. Oh, by the way, guys, don't forget to go on over to FB and Cooking with Big Rob. Also, IG, Robin Drew 61 Also, check me out on TikTok. I'm doing my thing. All right. So, I'm going to go ahead and dump a little flour up in this pot and get it popping. Get it popping. I saw somebody today put mustard on their chicken. A little boy, 11 years old, on, on Trick Daddy show. Y'all know who Trick Daddy is. Trick Daddy from Miami. I think he's, yeah, love and hip-hop Miami. Yeah, so now I'm rubbing in my chicken. So I'm going to give it a try one day with mustard. I don't know. I, I, you know, I'm strictly old school. I don't believe in all that new shit. I'm old school. But hey, don't want to try this is how you know your grease is ready. This is how you know your chicken is ready to go inside the grease. Just drop a little piece of flour. If that if that grease is bubbling, then the chicken is ready. I think I'll give it another minute. Look at this big old foil I bought from Walmart. That's crazy, right? Yeah, so this is a quick and easy meal. And yeah, this is the broccoli. And I'm going to be having little broccoli bites. Put my seasonings up. Cause I, I'm gonna put it, I don't, no, I don't use all that stuff on my chicken. Garlic and all that shit. I'm good. My sauce will be hot sauce. And I'm good, you know, I'm Gucci. Okay, I'll be back. Don't go nowhere. Guys, here's my nice golden brown hang on. Y'all see that? Now that's how chicken's supposed to look. But I do have two drums left in my pot here. But I want to cook those a little longer. Because one thing I'm not going to do is buy to do some half done ass chicken. That's not a good look for me. Okay? So that's how that go. I will be back with the finishing touch. You will be seeing the baked chicken with the broccoli. Guys, I, wanted, I want y'all to check out what Big Rob did over here. Check it out. I went on ahead and put me some garlic in. My Pyrex with my baked chicken. Look at that. What you know about that? Let me give y'all a little a, a closer look. Look. See that? Got the juices. Got the fresh broccoli on deck. The baked chicken. Very healthy meal. 
And then, of course, my flat, my fried chicken. So that's what we're having for tonight's dinner. Let me turn off my oven, a very quick meal. Now it's time to relax. But I do want to thank each and every one that has taken their time out tonight to watch my video. Okay? Don't forget to subscribe. Okay? Put on those notification bells. Comment down below. And, leave, and give me those fat thumbs up. I need them. Okay? And always share my content. Share, share, share. Know that I love you. God love you too. Peace.